everyone, I'm Indy and welcome back to my channel. Subscribe! So today I'm back with Willow. Hi. And Cullen. We recently did do a video on my channel. Um, it was chocolate? Trying new chocolate from Whitaker's, which will be posted once this video is out, will will have been posted. Today we'll be trying new food again because I just buy food. Yeah. Today I went to a shop called Asian Kai. I went and bought heaps of different weird flavors of chips that I thought we were gonna try. So, let's go. So, the first one, what one do you want to do? The biggest one to the biggest one. Okay, so we'll start with the smallest one. Good. Um, this one is called Golden Sweet Corn. And I think they're like sweet corn balls. I'm not sure, like little ball puffs with flavor of sweet corn. So we're gonna, there's a lot of air in these bags. So I think, I don't want to like pop it, so I think I'm gonna just tear it. Tear it, no, actually it won't do that. Uh oh, I don't want it to. I got it. Oh. There we go. What do they smell oh. like? Oh, well, they smell like cheese balls. Oh, they do. I think they just smell like sweet oh, corn. They smell like corn. Yeah, they smell like corn. Okay, so it's upside oh, down, so sorry if it's bugs you, but what the heck. So we're going to try one. Not yet. Remember, Cullen. Yes. Don't start eating until we've. Can they smell okay? Okay. So first it's going to smell like they And they're like bulls, so I think they're like, like little shape. Okay. So I think they're made out of corn. Let's go. Mm. Mm. That's it's not like the corn. It's like the corn pre cut corn. It tastes like baby corn. Yeah. That's good. And that pre cut one. I mm. love it. Mm. Wow. Those are really good. Nice. These I recommend if you find these in your nearest Asian store or maybe a supermarket. We're going to go across and see. Well, out of 10, what we thought of it. 10 out of 10? I think it was a 9 out of 10. They could have been, um, you know, I thought they were going to be little kernels of corn, but that's okay. 9 out of 10. They're good. 8, because they taste more cheese than corn. They taste like cheese balls. Okay, yeah. More than corn. The next one is nacho. Now, these ones are called panchos. Nacho cheese flavor. Now, I think they're just like normal Doritos, but I thought they looked cool, so we're going to try them. They might have more of a nacho cheese flavor. I'm not sure. Yeah. Again, I might have to. Yeah. That's nacho cheese. I might. Oh, they're the tear here thing. Whoa. Can I smell? Whoa. Wow. Oh, it went in my eye. Whoa. That doesn't smell like Doritos nacho cheese. Yeah, they do. No, they smell like Doritos. Um, they smell like chili ones. Kind of like yeah. a spice. I'm trying a lot of one. Well, they're all like broken up, I think. Oh, okay, if I just get a little one. Alright, that's a little one. Okay, I need yeah. like. Okay, let's go. Mmm, that looks like not for cheese. Okay. They taste more. They, okay, can I they say they taste like Doritos? Can I say, they say, can I say they taste better than Doritos? But okay, they anyway, taste, they, they taste, taste better. like cheesy Doritos. They taste better than Doritos. Can I start the rating? Okay. They basically like um, I love Doritos, that's 10 out of 10. They, they yeah. literally taste like Doritos. Mm. I thought they were going to be like... They're cheesy Doritos, kind of. I love kind Doritos. Of spicy or something? I love those. But, honestly, I like those. They are good. I like give it a 10 out of 10. Um, 9 out of 10. Okay. Cause they taste because they tasted more like cheesy Doritos. Yeah. Okay. Not okay. Next one. Wait, is that a sure that's the small? Oh yeah. Like, yeah. No, that's not. Right. Now these ones are called baconette strips. Now for all you bacon lovers out there, sorry to say, there's actually no meat in this. There are no. There's no actual bacon. No bacon was harmed in the making of these. It's bacon flavored. It's snack. bacon flavored. So because I'm vegetarian, I decided. Everyone in the comments was probably going to go out and be like, You're vegetarian, why are you eating that? Because there's no actual bacon in it, so... Mm, okay? So, I can't eat them. I feel like I've had these before. I don't know, why do they not... Just in case! You know, okay, good idea, good idea. Got it, okay. everyone says that's caution. Right. They smell like bacon. Oh my god, they actually do. 
Yay! Now before I went vegetarian, I was not a fan of bacon, so we're gonna see how this goes. Oh, juice. Oh, they do look like. What kind of person don't like bacon? Oh, they're that. so cute. They look like you know just. No bacon. Hey, Dad. Huh. Wanna try one? Yep. Try my one. Okay. Do they taste like bacon? Yeah. And they haven't even got bacon in them. Okay, let's go. They kind of taste like bacon. This one looks like barbecue yeah, chips, honestly. I mean, since I'm vegetarian and I can eat these, this is the closest thing to bacon I'll eat. Like, unless you just eat bacon. No, I'm not going to. Okay. What do you think? Um, probably five out of ten. I thought it was a three because it kind of tasted like barbecue crisps. Yeah, and it was a bit disappointing because it didn't really taste like bacon. You guys, I'm gonna break it to you. Ten out of ten. I don't taste like bacon, and I don't like bacon, so I'm actually happy it. they don't taste like bacon. I love it. Okay. So you don't know if it tastes like bacon. These ones they are kind of crumbly. Really These ones are kind of crumbly. But this one I thought was honestly the weirdest thing. I honestly sound like they're all crumbled up. These are crunchy chocolate flavored corn chips or corn snacks. Can I please open it? Hang on. At the back it says a crunchy snack dipped in real chocolate. No there, preservatives. So let's one. see. There's a different one. I can open it. The different, what's the different one? Woohoo! Can I open the onion chip one? Yeah. This is open oh. here. You want to try one of these? Is it still recording? Please tell me it's still recording. Yeah, please just Oh, thanks so much. <laughs> Dad, I want to say some of this to my friends and mommy. Do they want to try some? Do I need to All right. Yeah, please smell. Whoa! Please smell. They kind of smell like Cocoa Pops, but then... Oh my God. After taste, not. Dad, you got to try these. Okay. Oh my God, they smell like oh. those um things that you can get in French shakes, those twirly kind of Oh things. yeah, okay, you take one? Oh, it's That's tiny. They're tiny, but there's a lot of them. Take one. They're actually more than I thought. I thought they were ginormous. Right, okay. Are you ready? And then a different kind. Are you yeah, ready? See, do these, right. Comment below, do these look appetizing to you? Would you eat these? No. Okay. Three, two, one. They're basically just big of this. Oh, wait. They're basically just like Coco Pops. Okay. Except this. They are bad. I hate Coco Pops, and these are not bad. Yeah. It's like basically like just something right in your mouth, honestly. Yeah, they're so light and crispy. It's just corn snacks dipped in chocolate, like. They're good. You can make them. Honestly. It's cool. And how to make a really appetizing thing. A really nice thing. The rest of the sprouts and chocolate. Well, Halloween jokes. Alright, alright. Can you try one? They act so good. Sorry. They're actually good. They're actually good though! Okay, so we've got our second to last one that we're trying. These are, are onion rings. Now I think they have both tried these, but we're trying them again. I don't think so. But they are delicious, so we'll open them. Oh yeah, is this the last one? Oh yeah. Now this one isn't actually um, from the Asian store, and they're not chips. This is they're from the UK. This is from the UK. But we'll do those ones. Ru edible rush peppers, huh? It's basically. Can I just do those? Even though it's just tea. Do you know what? Is this one? Okay, I'll take them. Take them. Oh my god, they're ginormous. These oh. are what they look like. And these ones smell like onions. These. These are my favorite. These are made out of onions, of course. We didn't do ratings for the last one. Is that onion flavored? Oh, yeah, we didn't do ratings for the other one. Oh. But that oh. would have been a 10 out of 10. Oh, I see. For those, um, Coco chocolate puffs? Um, probably a 9. Mm. For yeah. these? Mm. These are honestly my favorite. Mm -hmm. I could eat a whole bag. Yeah, you can. I feel like chips. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Alright. Okay. One more. Right. Okay. Hey. The only thing I don't really like is how they're circle shaped. Right. Now. The last one we have here are called flying saucers. They're not, now, they're not chips. 
They're not chips, they're sweets. And they look like this. And, and this outside is kind of like a rice paper thing with sherbet in the middle. And then so we like, oh, yeah. So we're gonna eat um one of these each. And see what I mean we had one once but we had one uh, we had one when we just got them yesterday. So, so what you do to eat them? You put them in your mouth and you stuff them and then suck them and then It would disintegrate. Let them dissolve. Let's go. Yeah. They do kind of taste like paper. Yeah. Well, the outside stuff. does. Mm. And then the two. Uh uh. Sometimes you don't chew and then they just burst in your mouth. Mine of them. I just put it. Mm. That was actually good. The last thing we'll be showing you, we won't be eating any of these. These, oh, let's get the original. Are known as Percy Pigs. Very nice. Let's see if we can actually see this. Percy Pigs. Okay. Yeah, cool. Um, they are soft gums made with fruit juice. And these are really good. Um, I think you can only, you can only buy them in England, Marks and um, Spencer's. But lucky for us, our mum just recently went over there, so she brought us back some. Um, just saying, no pigs were harmed in the making of this. There is no. How come there's a vegetarian one? Suitable for vegetarian. Yeah, yeah, it's suitable for vegetarian. So, so um, and, oh no, they don't use gelatin. They use glucose. Glucose. Yep. Glucose syrup. Yep. Because um, they made a vegetarian one. Well, well they made another one that had um something. But these are vegeta suitable for vegetarians. There is no um gelatin, which I actually didn't know. No, no gelatin. Yes. They don't use meat. No Good. gelatin. Um, yeah, so these are the original ones. Now we are obviously as I said not going to eat these today, but I will video each of their reactions to each one when over the course of the year, whatever. We have lots here. So this is Percy Pigs. These are the original ones. So after Percy Pigs, we have Percy meets the Easter Bunny. And these are a mix of just Easter Bunny and Percy Pigs. Um, soft and juicy gums made of fruit juice, and these are just really cute. These are fizzy pigtails, and they're sour um, lollies. They're like shrilled as pigs. Um, this is Percy's family mix. So there's um, cute little babies in there. <laughs> no, and I said no pigs were harmed. And they said babies. I'm gonna check if these are all suitable for vegetarians. Um, and this is blow prodding Percy. It's got tigers, pandas, Percy obviously, Percy the man. Yep. So we have Percy's parents, and it's a man. It's a Percy pig, um, like the one old veggie generation. Oh, old, old generation. This one is Percy's piglet, so all his little pigs. They're like little gummy bear shaped, gummy head shaped ones. And the last one is Percy and Penny. They are married, basically. Yeah, they're just like the married ones. Yeah, the married. And all of these, um, I can tell you, all of these are suitable for vegetarians. So if you are a vegetarian, you live in the UK. Pick up some Not of these the from your local marks and centers and yeah. eat them because they're good. Now these ones are all suitable for vegetarians. Um, if you're yeah. vegan, I actually don't know because oh yeah, oh no, it might be vegan. They don't say suitable for vegans, but oh, they have beeswax. That's why. Okay, so these are all suitable for vegetarians, not vegan. But um, I'm sure there actually are ones you can probably get um, for vegans. But um, these ones here, two for vegetarian. If you're a UK, um, if you're from the UK, you're vegetarian, or you just love sweets, pick up yourself up some of these perfect pigs and have a good time and eat them while watching Netflix. Marks and Spencer's just Marks and Spencer. Well, I can't have just gone to get their lunch, so I'm signing out of this YouTube video. Um, I really hope you all enjoy, and I hope to see you next time for another video. Comment down below um, if any of these snacks looked appetizing to you. Also, um, if you are in, if you live obviously in the UK, you can buy a pair of Percy Pigs. Or if you have an Asian store near you, you can also see if you can find some of these snacks. Um, yeah. So anything, anytime, smile. I'll see you all in the next video. Bye!